Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to Vacuum, a cute game where you play a vacuum and help your owner do vacuuming things. System start. Ouch. It's been a while since Master activated me. Wow, we have a personification. I think I have to switch gears to steer. I'll need to pause my forward movement with space, then I can change directions. Uh, we're a little too fast for a vacuum. Look at that. We're vacuuming. We're such a good vacuum. We're totally not gonna end up like the little toaster. Man, this place is messy. Master! I'm doing my job, Master. Look. I'm vacuuming. What's that? Is that important? It looks like an important paper. Let me just suck it up. Evening vacuumed. I have a guest coming over shortly. Would you kindly sweep up the place and vacuum? I'll let you into the kitchen once this room is spotless. Sure, I mean... You seem like you're kind of a slob yourself. Gotta, gotta slow yourself down a bit. Get around those corners. Gotta get yourself a, a good good technique going on here. Get a regular ace combat of vacuums. Give me that turn on dime Macross Zero style. What is that? Any oh, it's a plant. It's like falling out of its uh, urn. Master, why are you having me suck up papers? Look, Master, I did. Are you proud of me? Good work. Praise me, Master. Which I prefer to use like owner. I don't know. It's kind of awkward being a well, a vacuum. I think like. I mean, if a third character from Little Toaster enjoyed being a vacuum, then I guess, I guess I can enjoy being one too. You have very kind of interesting paintings in the background. Is that one an eyeball? Look at me, master. I got extreme techniques. Sometimes you gotta stop and think, though. Uh, I don't mean about this game's story specifically, but like, we're playing a vacuum. Now, let's say, let's say back in the 90s of video games and everything, when things are coming out, the PlayStation's coming out, uh, Super Nintendo is kind of nearing its lifespan, or it's for Famicom, depending where you live. And like, did you did you sit down and think, man, I sure hope they make a game where we're a vacuum. Maybe you did. You did actually. It's it's a wonderful, it's a wonderful time. And we're kind of grinding here. Mind the basement. I may have overdone it last night. What are you talking about? Oh man, we've been. I've been sucking too much. Should've never sucked in all those papers. Clonk, clonk, clonk. This is a little more than overdone. But what do I care? I'm a store-bought thing. All I do is vacuum. What is that? I'm too heavy. The lift won't bring me up. I need to empty my basket. In fact, we have sentient thoughts. Huh? Ah, oh, Harper. Thank you for joining me. 
It's an honor to pick the brain of such a bright mind, sir. Oh, please. Enough flattery. <laughs> Care to join me on the balcony? I'm sure you'll absolutely fall for me. Can, you, can we just give credit to how good of a machine we are where we just clean up blood so easily? So slow. I really need to empty my basket. I should look for some kind of drain to dump all this stuff into. Pick some things up in the way. There's a drain. Oh, this should work. I can drop everything down the strain. Ah, I can move much easier now. Oh, we were sucking up hands. I got a hand to you. Little vacuum, you are... You are good at your job. Too bad we can't, uh... Suck away that. Just... Just, you know, just need to clean with this body. Here we go. Just let go of the Roomba. Okay, we need a fully empty basket. Ah, oh, yes. Dirty bathroom. Okay, but let's be honest here. I understand the basement, but like, why is everything else so dirty? Have some standards. Oh, I see. Things kind of got dragged around in more than one place. Was it the extent of like a slasher movie? That chased a person like throughout the entire house? Where are you running? You'll love to meet my vacuum. Getting a little slow again. Plus, I can't get this blood. There's like waste baskets in my way. Oh my god, what have you been doing of your life? Look how much of a mess this is. Learn some lessons from, like, Hannibal or something, like, be a little more efficient. I'm getting a little slow. Getting kind of heavy. Move all this grime everywhere, I mean. Of course we're going to get clogged up. Oh, this should work. I can drop everything down this drain. Ah, oh, I can move much easier now. Okay, but this this vacuum has a very strong self-image. Like, they're very confident in what they do. Okay. This house is looking real good. Oh my god, you have a huge balcony. That is amazing. Hey. Where's everyone? I guess I must have chased them out on the balcony? Master? There. The house is all clean. Time for me to return to my closet. I hope Master will like the work I did. We're such a loyal tool. <laughs> Master? I guess the real person who ended up falling for someone was you.
So that's it for Vacute. A fairly, a fairly cute little game, actually. Unironically, I think it's a little cute, you know? We can always appreciate a, a, a sentient vacuum cleaning it, doing its job in a very well done way. I will note that this uh, this game is actually from a somewhat established developer. Well, they, they've released one other game, it's actually out. I have not played it yet, it's called Lockhart Indigo or something. Uh, I think it's some kind of thriller RPG Make Your Rest game if you want to go look at. I haven't made a playthrough of it yet or anything like that. I think it's fairly long. Uh, maybe one will happen someday, I'm not sure. But it looked kind of interesting. So I thought I should just note that just for the developer's benefit. I, I, like I said, it is a... To me anyway, it's a fairly few, cute game. So good on them for discovering another little niche concept no one else has really thought of yet. Anyway, so if you go for once you play Blood Cube, I'll see you guys later and take it easy.